everyone, I'm Robin. And I'm Carly. And we are starting our Think Pink, Pink week. week. And uh, if you go to my website at mypinkstamper.com, we are actually um, dedicated to one of our scrapper friends. But if you'd like to join with us uh, throughout the week and you have somebody to dedicate it to, maybe not uh, going through breast cancer, but maybe going through something else, feel free to join in and have fun with us. We're going to try to have challenges and videos and I'll have lots of just different giveaways and fun ideas that you can check out. Uh, we're going to start out by doing today this, I'm not sure if it's a challenge, um, we're just going to show a project and if you'd like to make something and get inspired, it's a, what are we doing? Pink Christmas. Yeah, pink Christmas. So Something. Yeah, something pink. My hair is acting up. Something pink you can do, uh, we're going to do a pink Christmas card mm -hmm. and you can do a pink scrapbook page. I love it that this year and I went in the scrapbook stores and even at CHA. Yeah, there was a lot of, a lot pink, of pink Christmas, Christmas stuff. stuff and of course that made me very happy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no more laughing for me. <laughs> My voice is almost dead. Okay, so anyway, um, Carly's already home by the time this is broadcasting. Carly went home on Sunday, which is tomorrow, uh, but we wanted to, she wanted to be a part of it with me and also uh, Tammy over on cricketcritters.com is also participating in this week, so check it out. And so here we go. Our first project is going to be a Cricut card using Winter Frolic Cricut cartridge. And we hope you like it. Of course, it's simple and easy to do. And um, we'd love to see what you come up with, too. So we might go ahead and add a linky over on uh, mypinkstamper.com. So you can kind of, you know, do it if you'd like to and show us. This one's not for a giveaway today, but it's just for fun. Okay, so we'll see you and join us for the rest of Think Pink Week. Bye-bye. Bye. Okay, we are going to be cutting this Christmas tree that's on page 48, and we're cutting it four and three quarters. I have my blade set at six, pressure max and speed max, and I'm going to go ahead and press this right here for my bottom part. Now it's going to be the light green. And then we're going to be cutting this two times because we're cutting this the darker green and we need to also cut the tree trunk right here. So let's go ahead and we will cut the shift, shift tree and we're cutting that in green and then we're going to, we're going to also cut it in brown. Just hit your repeat last. Right Carly? Yep. <laughs> Love the repeat last button. Me too. Okay, so let's move this over here and just hit repeat last, like Carly just said, if you heard her. Repeat last. And then we're going to go over to the pink paper and we're going to do the same thing. We need to cut it two times. So let's hit our layer button right here and we're going to press the tree and press cut. Now just hit your, hit your repeat last when you're on your light pink. A lot of little circles to glue. Repeat last. And our last cut we're doing is the star and some more little decorations for the tree. And just hit your shift. Keep your layer button on. Hit shift and your Christmas tree and cut. Now let's put this card together. Carly and I are going to finish up this card for you. We have, how big is this Carly? Six by 12. Yes, six by 12. And we're going to fold it in half. And you can use a six by six envelope for this and they carry them at online stores. I'm going to find some online stores. Okay. And now here's my layers. I have the green, I have five and three quarters by five and three quarters. And we will go ahead and, hmm, let's not put this one on yet. Okay, now I have this pattern paper that I picked up at the craft store today. I can't remember who this was by. Do you remember who this was by, Carly? Uh, is it two bugs in a rug? Yay! Carly's right, it's three bugs in a, ru in a rug. And we met them at CHA. Yeah, they were so fun. Really awesome. Okay. And we're going to put this on here. So this was five and a half by five and a half. So everything's just down a quarter. And this was four, four inches by, let me see, 
four and three quarters. And that's going to go right here. Do you kind of see how I have this? I have it where there's a, a little area around the top and on the sides, but not on the bottom. Okay, we're just going to add this on here. And just try to kind of eyeball and see if it's even. Let me see here. Let me eyeball it. And it looks pretty even. What do you think, Carly? Yes? Yay! Okay, perfect. Okay, now we're using some paper tray ink ribbon. Love it. Satin. And I've already put together the tree with its million dots. And Carly and I put this together. And that's going to be right here. So let's go ahead and add this tape. Right, Carly? Before I lose my voice? Yes. Gulp, gulp. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Cheater method style. I love these colors together. They're so cute. I'm so glad we got that paper. I am too. It's got pink and blue and green and we added brown and yellow and darker pink and lighter green just had a lot, ah, we just had a lot of fun with it Okay, we can go ahead and add this onto our blue I've got a big old shadow today okay Add this on here on our card. Now we are going to decide what stamp we're going to use because this is Think Pink Week in honor of breast cancer. I wanted to use one of my new stamp sets and this one's called Pink Alicious Puns. And I want to use the Dazzling stamp on here. You could use Pinking of You. Um, you know, there's Believe. Yeah, Pink Alicious. But I thought dazzling would be fun, be fun since we're making this like kind of a Christmas card. Okay, well let's add the stamp first. The dazzling. Dazzling. And we're going to add it before we actually officially add. We're just going to add it right here. Dazzling. Perfect. And I just need some dimensionals, Carly. Will you have me some dimensionals, please? And I'll go ahead and get this ribbon ready. I love this card! Did you find some? Okay. Look, you have four hands. Just kidding. Look at it. <laughs> it's the best way to scrap our Tuckmik cards. Four hands are better than one. <laughs> one. They sound like, um, what's that Brady kid's name? On one of those episodes, you probably oh. don't know because you're nine years younger than I am. Whatever, I Peter, totally watched the Peter, you know how when he yeah. lost his voice and he's like, oh, you yes. gotta keep, keep. That's what I sound like right now. And you all know that. <laughs> <laughs> Good thing that, um, yeah. Oh, you guys like my rubber band thing too? It's cute. Thanks. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Whipping it, me. Whip it. Whip it real good. I'll whip my hair back and forth. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oh, okay, almost done, and it's dazzling. What do you it think? Is Isn't this cute? It's so cute. I love it. I'm so excited. I'm going to lift this up because normally I do the ribbon after. Dazzling. Right there. So cute. What do you think we need? Stickles. Stickles. Do do stickles to the rescue. Um, just get me some clear with sparklies. Icicle. Icicle that. <laughs> Cut it. Okay. I hope this one's not clogged up. Sometimes. Nice sometimes they get a little. How about we make the star? Oh, I love it. I have diamond. You know, we only need this one color. Okay. Well, just in case it was. Oh, in case it was cloggied. Yep. Cloggied up. Cloggied. Cloggy duppy, okay. and I'm only gonna do like the bright pink ones. Cause you know how some of the ornaments are shiny and some of them aren't. Oh yeah, I do know. Okay, what does that look? How does that look? Ooh, that's pretty. Okay, so there you go, and we hope you have a dazzling, dazzling, <laughs> dazzling not dazzling. dazzling. We hope you have a 
dazzling, dazzling day. day. <laughs> Bye.